Morning Springs and Lake. Today is Tuesday, May 25th, 2021. Today is a day number six. At this time, would you please rise and join me in the Pledge of Allegiance. I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the Republic for which it stands, one nation under God, indivisible with liberty and justice for all. A very good Tuesday morning to everyone. I hope that you're all doing well and that you're ready for another great day. We have the following announcements for today. Students enrolled in Algebra 1 will be taking the Keystone exam today and tomorrow. Following the announcements this morning, I'll call for Algebra students to report to their assigned testing location. Seventh grade students, you'll be in the auditorium lobby. And eighth grade students, you'll be in the library. These locations will be closed to all other students this morning. So if you're a sixth grade student and you're going to music today or tomorrow, you must enter the music wing by going past Mrs. Ruckel and Mr. Henredig's classrooms. Attention eighth grade students, drafts of those speeches for the eighth grade recognition ceremony in June are due to the main office by tomorrow. I can't wait to read what you've written, so please get them to the main office by tomorrow morning. Don't forget that the library is sponsoring a virtual spring book fair. This is a great opportunity for you to secure your summer reading books for next school year, or simply to grab a title or two for your summer reading enjoyment. Those summer reading lists are posted to the school's website, so check them out. More details about the virtual book fair are available on the library webpage. And speaking of the library, they've got a special event planned for this Thursday morning. We're excited to welcome author Jordan Sonnenblick for a virtual visit on Thursday morning during periods one and two. Now, I know that many of you have read Jordan's books, and this is your chance to get to hear from him as he speaks exclusively to Springton Lake Middle School. The program is going to begin at 8.15 a.m. You'll remain in your first period class during periods one and two. If you're a fully virtual student, your teacher will provide you a link to access the Zoom session. If you're an in-person student, your teacher is going to project the presentation on the screen in your classroom. Following the visit, you'll resume your normal schedule for the day, beginning with third period. Attention seventh grade students, the sign up for the Future Cities program has been shared with you in Schoology. So hey, discuss this option with your parents if it sounds interesting to you and complete that short application form to secure your spot today. Attention eighth grade students who are interested in playing football next year at Pencrest High School. Coach Smith from Pencrest is going to be here on Thursday during core extension to meet with you and to provide more details about the program. The meeting is going to take place in the cafeteria. Also, if you're an eighth grade student and you're interested in playing field hockey next fall at Pencrest, Coach Hartzell, who is the assistant varsity coach, is going to be holding an informational meeting for you if you're interested in trying out for the JV or varsity team. That meeting is going to be next Tuesday, a week from today, June 1st, in room C007, and that's going to be taking place during your lunch period. Congratulations go out this morning to Zach Wava, winner in last week's student council contest. Zach had a pretty darn good impersonation of me. So I guess I know who I need to contact if I'm gonna be absent one day between now and the end of the school year. So congratulations, Zach, and also to all of the people who entered in the contest. And speaking of contest, it's time for your weekly feature, Trivia Tuesday. So here's your chance to put your trivia to the test and to earn some bonus Spartan Bucks. Submit your answer using the Google form only. Don't message me and don't email me. I love you, but I don't need all those messages in my inbox. Just fill out that Google form in Schoology. Okay, so let's test your knowledge on a topic that should be 
very, very clear for all of you, and that is social media. And hey, no cheating. Don't Google that answer. Let's see what you know. So here's your question for today. This popular social media app was originally launched in July of 2011 under the name Peekaboo. Two months later in September, the app was relaunched under its current name. Can you name the social media app? All right, good luck. Submit your answers using that Google form. Okay, Spartans, let's do this. Work hard today and treat one another with kindness and respect. And of course, keep doing those things that will help us stay healthy and safe. That means masking up, washing up, and backing up. This concludes our announcements for today. I thank you for your attention. And as always, let's make it a great day or not. The choice is yours.